No pienso rebobinar. Claro que pasa, hombre. <ríe> Vamos, solo faltaba. De hecho, no sé si se podría... De hecho, no. Una conversación no se puede rebobinar. Eso desde luego. Creo yo, vamos, al menos este tipo de decisiones no creo que se pueda, pero tampoco lo voy a hacer, ¿eh? Y buscar pruebas, pues, eh, vamos. En la bolsa igual. No, no podemos. Violín, ropas, folleto, biblia. No sé yo dónde vamos a encontrar algo. Almost forgot what Kate looks like when she smiles. It's way too emo in here. Kate isn't that gloomy. Until like Kate even makes notes in her Bible. My parents never once took me to church. Bien I had por nothing ellos. to rebel against. I don't know what to believe now. Kate's room is usually immaculate. For her, this must be a pigsty. Kate is all alone dealing with this video bullshit. I hope her mother doesn't disown her. Veo que sus padres saben del video. Pues sí. Desde luego que sí. En fin. Pero igualmente esto de prueba no nos sirve absolutamente de nada. Kate y un violín menos. Y bueno, eso en el caso de que de verdad la hayan drogado. Vamos, eso está por ver. That's a lot of tears. She's going to go through boxes. I had no idea that Kate ever hung out with Alyssa and Stella. Es un poco desconsiderado estar haciendo fotos a conejos en la habitación de Kate, dadas las circunstancias, creo yo. Ouch. She left out amnation. Querida Katie, ningún espíritu ni demonio pudo haberme preparado para lo que observé en ese vídeo. Y al igual que una prostituta, mostraste tu vil cuerpo ante los ojos de Dios. Madre de Dios, vaya familia que tienes, Kate. Normal que te pasen cosas raras. De su tía es esto. Rezaré junto a mi iglesia para que tu alma sea salvada del fuego eterno. Maravilloso. A ver si hay algo más por aquí. Kate really has a doting father. Bueno, veo que van todos por el mismo tema, exactamente igual. ¿Y esto de cuándo es? ¿Es de después del vídeo? No, no aparece fecha, ¿no? No. Aunque bueno. Todo lo demás es de después del vídeo. Vale, pues... Desde luego aquí no hemos encontrado nada, pero supongo que si encontramos algo no será en su habitación. Digo yo. Bueno, vamos a intentar buscar a Victoria, salvo que Chloe opine lo contrario. LOL, vale. Igualmente voy a intentar primero ver algo aquí. Pues no, ni caso. Fine, I won't disturb you. Fine, I won't disturb you. Bueno, vale. ¿Podemos hacer algo con el tema de las pintadas o no? La de la pared va a ser difícil de quitar, pero esta en teoría, pues nada. 
con un pañuelo o algo, se debería poder quitar. Digo yo. This totally reminds me of being a kid in my room. Sorry, mom. I can make my bed whenever I want. Oh yeah. Bueno, ha sido bastante lento el inicio de este segundo episodio de Life is Strange, la verdad. Realmente como el primero, aunque supongo que ahora empezará a subir el interés, así que tenemos que ir con Chloe. What's happening, Dana? Everything cool between you and Juliet? Oh, yeah. Thanks again for releasing me from her captivity. By the way, the best and biggest news of the day is that Trevor asked me to the Halloween shindig. That's awesome, Dana. At least we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Borrow one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your bitch Warren. Uh, I'm not big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So, are you coming to the party or not? No, sorry. It's just not my thing. You came to Blackwell to discover yourself, not hide in your dorm. I won't discover myself avoiding projectile vomit from bro dudes. Thanks anyway. Hello, Juliet. Hey, Max. Did you check out Kate's hot video yet? That's so not cool. I didn't get wasted on camera and get busy with the Vortex Club. Kate's not like that and you know it. Really? Check her out and tell me what she's like. Do you believe everything you see? Like Zachary sexting Dana? Touché. Now I feel like an ass. Thanks for finding out the truth yesterday. What did you do about Victoria pulling that crap? Nothing... yet. My mind works in devious ways, too. Glad to see you're back in action. You have a good heart, Max. And I won't watch Kate's video anymore. Or pass it on. That's the spirit. Thanks, Juliet. Sure. Talk to you later. Sí, a buenas horas. A buenas horas. Birds are flocking around Samuel. No hay foto de esto en serio. Joder. Hey Samuel, you're up early. Oh, hello, young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet, and I can feel the animals waking up with me. That's one thing I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. What animals do you see in the forest? Don't laugh, but I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me, like it was trying to communicate. Oh, that's your spirit animal. Nothing weird there except you saw yours. Could be a sign about your destiny. What do I know? My spirit animal is a squirrel. So, 
What did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the Earth to get our shit together. I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anything like that before. I so don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. Me da un montón de miedo este hombre. Can't Blackwell have at least one no football zone? Release the Kraken. Come on, squirrels. Time for your 15 minutes of fame. Este es un mensaje para informarle de que los intentos de difamar y chantajear a mi hijo se verán con muchos abogados y consecuencias legales. No eres la primera estudiante en Blackwell intentando esto. Espero que seas la última. Considera esto una advertencia final educada. Bueno, el padre de Nathan. Que es distinto, no es el mismo que este. Que es bastante más amenazante. Max, check it out. Warren, what are you doing here? Well, nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. I owe you. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? He's dangerous. I don't want you to get involved. You got me there, but lay low. Nathan Prescott is going to get his karma soon. Weird fucking week. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that drive-in is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! No, I don't think I can concentrate on going out to the movies. I just feel like escaping. Fine. Be a damn dirty human. I'll go eat myself. Bueno, vamos a centrarnos en lo de Chloe primero, aunque esto no tenga ya vuelta atrás. Lo siento, Warren. David talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. This has something to do with Kate. Or Rachel.
Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exactly the same. Bueno, estamos en el bar de la madre de Chloe, que al parecer hace tiempo que Max no pasa por aquí y dice que está igual. No sé si tendremos cierta libertad por aquí. Glad somebody is. Don't try to. I bet he's seen a lot of changes to Arcadia Bay in his lifetime. I wouldn't dream of it. A este hombre le ha tocado la lotería, pero no puedo hablar con esta gente. She looks busy and stressed. Ahora sí. Hi, you look lost. Close. Do you know if the bus has come yet? The online schedule isn't working. I just got off the school bus, but I'm sure the regular bus is coming too. Oh, that's a relief. I can't be late for this job interview. I can't believe I have to take a bus all the way to Newport just to find a second job. Are things that bad here? Where are things good? I can't even afford to live here. Well, good luck. Thanks, I sure need it. Vale, Chloe llega tarde, que... Pillemos un asiento. Vale. Hombre, imagino que aquí habrá más cosas por hacer antes de entrar, así que vamos a investigar todo esto, aunque bueno, no creo que pueda ir muy lejos, o sí. Nope, I don't want to go there. Hombre, yo sí quiero ir, Max, es el tema, yo sí quiero. Pero bueno, y cruzar tampoco, ¿no? No. No time for chit chat. I'm a millionaire. Yep. Got my lottery ticket right here. Waiting for the bus so I can cash it in. Yo, si me tocara la lotería, no iría con el boleto ganador por ahí tan tranquilamente, mucho menos enseñándolo y gritándolo. Pero bueno, pescador, salva nuestra ciudad. Pues vale. Ah, mira, ahí está el faro, ahí al fondo, el faro que vemos al final del primer episodio. Una escena realmente muy bonita. Me encanta esa parte final con la música, con las cámaras que usa. Y hombre, tengo ganas de encontrar a Chloe de nuevo porque me parece a mí que es lo más interesante de momento de lo que es la historia. Bastante más que todo esto de Kate y, y Victoria y demás. Que bueno, pues sí, puede estar bien, pero no, no es comparable a la historia de Chloe y su amiga desaparecida. There's that dirty RV from the other day. Uy. Un perro y un tipo. Uh, stop that. Stop. No barking. 